All right. Uniden Bearcat 980 SSB. The talk of the town, both good and bad. Some people love them, some people hate them. I think if I was going to keep this thing, I would keep it as a base. I would tell you right up front, the weather channel failed. Pretty common thing. I don't know the fix for it. Uh, other than that, the radio works flawlessly, except for the weather. It may be a... I'm not sure what it is, but it does not work. It'll scan, but it does not work that I know of, and I may be missing something. The only reason why I'm getting rid of this thing is, one, I like the older stuff. You can see... Cobra 29, an old t berry an old Navajo, an old Washington. Of course, I do have a striker. It actually drives a, an amp I got, a really nice channel tank. But now, back to this. I just want to let you know I'm selling this thing. I've had it probably a year and a half. I think I paid 130 bucks for it, somewhere in that area. Uh, no, I'm not going to try to get that out of it, but I'll turn this thing on. That's the color scheme I got. You can definitely change the color to whatever color. If you want to know about this radio, you can go on YouTube and find out how to operate it, set it, and everything. I'm not going to make that long of a video. I will tell you today, this is day is loaded with skip. I'm way out in the middle of nowhere on a farm with an IMAX. I talk to a lot of locals in the evening. I don't talk a lot of skip, but every radio I've tried today, I can't get a radio check. It really sounds good. Alrighty. I will tell you, if you want to watch this, it'll tell you what your uh, SWRs are. Let me change it to that. There is a switch for that. SWRs. I'll confirm that with my meter. It barely moves. I've got great SWRs. Dead key on this one. Hold on, let me turn the have that meter up there too high. Get on the right scale. SWR is almost nothing. Dead key. Dead key is about half a watt or a little more. I had this thing driving my big dog amp. It did well. I sent it. They kind of set it for that amp. And you guys can make adjustments on that if you want. I'm not that guy. Audio, audio. It swings about four watts. This is a low drive amp it was working on, so you didn't want to crank it up too much. From what I hear, you can't get a whole lot out of these. I will try a radio check on 19. I can tell you, not had a lot of luck reaching anybody today, just because there's so much trash in there. Break one nine. How about a radio check, check, check. Break one nine. How about a radio check? Oh, thank you for the answer back there. It's been a mess today with all this uh, skip and everything. Thank you for the radio check. Hopefully it's coming in okay. Yeah, like that. I'm talking skip there. It's uh. And four. Thank you, feller, for hollering back at me. So, it does work. I had to crank the amp up to reach anybody. I talked with Skip. Squelch works good. Uh, there's a lot of neat features on it. You know, it's got the noise blanker. I'll take that off there. It'll really get noisy. There's both of them. 
So I'm going to sell this thing. I will tell you this, if you want a adapter, I'll throw that in. It's going to be the pins that fit the radio, and it'll adapt down to any four-pin Cobra. I'll throw that in. It will have the factory mic. You can add whatever mic you want, and I'll throw in the power cord also. So anyway, this radio is going to go bye-bye. I enjoyed it. But I'm liking the older ones better. I, this will make somebody a great new base, especially for a newbie. I've heard you put them in the vehicles, they work great, but they don't take the vibration that great. And the face plates will go bad when the sun hits them. So I've had about a year and a half. It's really great. Again, the weather channel is gone. I hate that. That was very handy. I've actually bought a another scanner slash weather to replace this but this makes somebody a good radio thanks for watching